Hey YouTube, it's Metro Game 75 here today, and today we're playing Winter Dream. This is a new game that came out today, December 1st. So let's get started. Um, vacation, of course. Um, okay. Hey, it's been a while since I've been in this town. I'm finding the soldier. I can't, honestly can't remember what happened the last time I was here. I guess I just don't have very good memory. Well, I guess I should introduce myself. My name is Karen Duff, and I'm coming over to my uncle's place during my winter break. His house double as a restaurant, and he's likely to make me work. I don't really mind, though. It would give me something to do. I look up at the sky, happy to be away from home. It's not like the terrible there. I just like being in a new environment every now and then. Walking through town, I look around, see every building. And I feel like they haven't changed since the last time I was here. It doesn't take too long to get to my uncle's place. When I get inside, there doesn't seem to be too many places, people there. I only notice one person as she's cleaning one of the tables. I guess I might as well introduce myself. I might as well introduce myself. If she works here, I'm probably going to see her a lot. You there? Huh? Are you talking to me? There's no one else here, dumbass. <laughs> Are you just going to stand there? Ah, sorry. If you're not here for anything, get the hell out. Hey, you don't have to be so fucking rude. Like, jeez. What's with this girl? I just met her and she's already being a bitch. I'll just be staying here from now on. Oh, so you're Karen. Yes, Karan. Oh, shoot. <laughs> How do I mess up that name? It's not Karen, it's Karan. What about you? I'm Velda. Velda? What, are you supposed to be Velma? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Well, that's a shitty joke. Now I need to get back to work. Stay out of my way, and there won't be any problems. Got it. After that, I leave the restaurant area. Ah, she doesn't have to be such of a bitch. Sheesh. Let it take long for me to find my Uncle Daniel. Ah, Karan. You've gotten a lot bigger. Ah, yeah. It's nice to see you again. Don't be so nervous. I used to change your diapers and give you baths. You're making it sound kind of creepy. <laughs> oh, sorry. I didn't mean to. Anyways, I see you. You met Velda already. Yeah, I, I know she's a bit rough around the edges, but try to get along with her if you can. Um, okay. Why don't you go and pack your things? Ah, she, she doesn't have to be such a bitch about it. Like, she, she's just like a hard-headed. <sighs> After he lets me go, I head to my room to unpack my things. I'm not really sure if I can get used to this place. Having an annoying girl like Velda around all the time, I'm sure that'll make it hard. I better not worry about it too much. I'm going to be staying here from now on, so I'm just going to have to put it up with her. I end up going to bed early. Are you going to be in bed all day? All my eyes to see Velda. Why are you in my room? Your uncle told me to wake you up. Now get your ass out of bed. Yeah, go away. What was that? What are you doing in a boy's room? Are you some kind of a pervert? She smacks me. Okay, that sound effect. Ow. I only came to wake you up, you idiot. There's no way I want to be like that with someone like you. Yeah, she's a Tsundere, guys. She storms off. I guess I I should get up before I piss off piss her off even more. <laughs> I wait, wait, downstairs to the restaurant, my uncle approaches me. Morning. Yeah, morning. Hey, let's have a laugh. Not a morning person, are you? Not really. We're gonna have to get used to it. Yeah, I kind of figured. Well, since you're in town, why don't you get a, go go outside and get yourself familiar with the area? It's been so long since you were here, so I doubt you remember where anything is. You don't need me to work. You can work later. He's telling you to get the hell out of your sight. I wouldn't put it like that, but yeah, you, you should go outside for now. I guess it wouldn't hurt. Then quit wasting time and get out there. Alright, so I'm going. Sheesh, what is she, my mom? Like, she's telling me what to do and shit. Like, sheesh. Alright, I go outside my town on my own will, but at the same time, I feel like I was forced to. I wonder where I should go first. As I walk, I ended up bumping to someone. Ah! Turns out to be a girl my age. Hmm. Uh. I'm sorry. I wasn't paying attention. The girl supposed to be not aware of her surroundings. Are you okay? Ah. And she does answer my question and just runs off. Jeez, what was that about? Best not to worry about it. 
I'll just try to get myself familiar with the area, you know. So I walk through town, a girl ends up approaching me. I haven't seen you around. You new here? Ah, uh, yeah. I'm Karan. I'm staying at my uncle's place during the winter break. Nice. Oh, so you're Daniel's nephew? You know him? Yeah, everyone in town knows him. Wow. He lets us all knowing you be coming. Great, that means I must be in the talk of the town. Ah. Oh, right. Like I'm the Pope. I'm Rose. If you ever need anything, I'll be willing to help. Ah, thanks. So, what do you think of your own town so far? Eh, I don't know. I just moved into my uncle's place yesterday. I think it'll take some time. Okay, I understand. Of course, you want to like this place right away. Are you disappointed? Not really. At least you didn't hate this place. I see. That's all I need to know. Okay. I'm sure we'll see more of each other in the future. I hope so. <laughs> Wait, did I just say that out loud? You really want to see me again? Uh, yeah. We definitely will. See you later. Rose walks away. That girl seems really nice. Why couldn't she have been the one working under my uncle? It would be so much easier. Ah, oh, my friend got it. It's super. <laughs> it's 8721. I return to my uncle's restaurant and I find that girl that ran away from me eating alone at the table. Without really thinking, I end up approaching her. Hey, the girl doesn't say anything. I just, I just focus on her food. Are you bothering the customers? No. Why don't you just leave her, leave her alone? He's not bothering me. Really? Really? I think. You think? Is he bothering you or not? Ah! <laughs> You're the guy that bumped to me earlier. Karan. Hey, it was an accident. It's not that deep. <laughs> Wait. It was my fault. Anyways, I'm sorry we bumped to each other. Um, I'm Karan. I'll be staying here from now on. When? Huh? Well, my name is Gwen. <laughs> ah. Hmm. Do you always eat alone? Are you usually this nosy? <laughs> what? Not always. I thought this rose is with me. I see. I'll let you get back to eating. Okay. I'm not gonna end up putting me to work af that afternoon. God, you suck. Oh, come on. Hey, what about it? What's that about? Did you ever never learn how to clean? I'm doing my best, okay? And you've forgotten to order multiple times? Oh, well, sorry for not having a photographic memory. Just quit screwing up. Sorry. I quietly get to sweeping near the front door. As I swept, I feel a bit frustrated. Now, all Velda's done this entire time I've worked here is complain. I surely hope I won't have to put up with all this time. Hey, Velda. What? I can tell she's annoyed. Has it been just you and your uncle working here? Yep, I see. You've really been doing everything else by yourself. Is there a problem with that? No, it just seemed like it would be, though. <laughs> I'm fine. Don't you worry about me. Right, sorry. Are you settling out and okay? It seems to be doing fine. I see. Well, this is starting to feel awkward. Just shut up and work. Yes. <laughs> what is she, the boss? Their shared dream. What the hell? Well, is this the end? Ah, wow, looks like I come this far. It's like 9 minutes... 30 seconds in the video. Or maybe it's the prologue? I mean, it's gotta be the prologue somehow. Why does it got some Hatsune Miku music? <laughs> I mean, I'm not really trying to be, I'm not really complaining, but I don't mind this. So 
There might be more though, if I just like pick like different routes. Might be more. Who's this? Well, this is it from here. I guess it's the end. Oh, Strawberry Love. Artist is Pocket Sound. Okay. It sounded like Hatsune Miku, though. Wait, that was this opening thing. Shoot. My. Damn, I didn't get to read the whole thing, but it's alright. Well, I guess that's the end, isn't it? Oh, never mind. I ended up feeling pretty tired by the time I got into bed last night. Now that I've rested, I better get up before Velda bitches. You gonna get up sometime this year? Too late. Yeah, I'm getting up. Good. Oh, smiley face. I'd have to kill you if you didn't. Sorry. Just get up already. How was your walk around the town? It was fine. I'm sure you appreciate some more time to get familiar with town, right? Really? It's your winter break. I like it if you had some... Freedom? Okay. Alright, get going. I'll put you back to work when you get back. Got it. What should I do? I can always hang out with someone. Would I spend my time alone? Uh, let's go with Gwen. No. Hmm. I want to go either. Let's go with Gwen. Let's see what how this goes. I find Gwen outside. Hey. Hi, hi. <laughs> oh, what are you doing? Walking. I see. Walking is nice. Yeah. Oh, a cat. She starts running off. Hey, wait. What the hell? Why'd you run off like that? Huh? All oh, right. You were talking to me. Um, cats are cute, aren't they? Uh, they're very cute, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> yes. They're very cute. Aren't they? Uh, yeah. So what about that cat you ran after? What cat? Oh. There it is. Oh, she's running after it again. Come on, wait. Thanks to Gwen, I didn't have much time to stand still. Damn, it's like she just really doesn't want to talk to me that much, huh? I've still got some time. Who should I be hanging out with now? Uh... Oh, let's go with Rose. Yes. I want to see Rose again. Let's go. Let's go see her. It doesn't take too long for me to find her. Karan? Hey. So, what are you doing? I'm taking food to the bank. To the food bank. Do you always do stuff like this? Yep. Am I getting your way? No. Why would you think that? Oh, I just don't want to be bothering you. You know? I'm. No, you're not bothering me. That's fine. Would you like to come with me? Oh, yeah, let's go with her. Yeah, I'll go with you. Thanks. And then together we deliver the food to the bank. The two of us split after that. After I'm done hanging out with her, I decided to walk around for a while. I soon realized how much time has passed. I need to get back to the restaurant. I end up working again and Velda continues to complain about my mistakes. After that, I get ready for bed. <laughs> These past few days have been something. I'm just not sure how to feel about everything. I better just enjoy the rest of my vacation. I quickly get to sleep. The next morning I end up getting up before Velda comes into my room. You're up early. Ah, oh, yeah. So you need more time outside? No. So you can get through town without getting lost now? I like to work. Really? Yeah, please let me work. Oh, okay then. Spend the rest of my time with vacation working? They bar spending time with anyone I met. I just did work for my uncle and didn't go out much. Everyone I met there was just another person in my life. They didn't have any, any special significance to me or, or anything. 
Whereas if I made different choices, things would be different. However, you can't undo what you've done in real life. That's just one unfortunate truth. Neutral ending. All alone. Damn. All right. There's, I'm going. To, I'm going to try to see if I can do more of this game now. At this point. So this is the neutral ending. All alone. All right, I'm gonna go the other way. So let's look through these credits, and I'll just tell you. Actually, I can just discuss right now. So. This is the end. This is the neutral ending that I got right now. So after that, I'm going to try to see if I can get more. So, so I can just help you guys for like guides and all that stuff. So you guys could like um figure out what to do this, what to go next, and this and that in the video. So yeah, well like about 15 minutes. About to hit about to hit 16 minutes in this video right now. Let's wait through these credits to go through. I mean, I wish there's a way you could speed up the cold credits and all. So, um, yeah, let's just watch this credits and then from there, I'll just take you guys to the end of the video and stuff and what's also going to happen for the coming weeks as well. Alright, that is the end of today's video, everyone. So, thank you so much for watching the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to check out the giveaway that's coming up this week. That's going to be ending soon. And the new one that's going to come out next week as well. And stay tuned for this game because I'm going to be doing more guides on how to beat, on how to get each achievement. So, yeah. I'll see you guys in the next one.